Michelle from Waffle TV, and we're here today with sketch comedy duo Shirley and Shirley. How are you guys doing? Really, really good. Good. So, good. tell us a little bit about your show. Well, it's uh, Shanine Shirley, the wife and I, and it's a character sketch duo, and it's a sketch show with a melange of various characters, all loud, proud, brassy, bold as you like, um, from from all over the world. Um, you will hear a lot of accents in our show, and it's not for the fake hearted, is it, Shirley? No, definitely not for the fake hearted. Yeah, you've got to, you've got to come with a strong ticker, looped up before you see our show. And it's, uh, it's been great fun, it's been appealing to all sorts, the young, the old, the infirm. So it's been going very well. Brilliantly. So how did you two meet? We went to secondary school with each other. Oh, right. So we've known each other since, you know, the summer of 69. It's been oh, very long time. Right. I was actually Shirley's prefect. Oh, um, yeah, cool. So uh, we've got the same birthday, three years apart. And uh, she was a first year and I was, um, I had to look after her as the third year. And I spotted her, spotted her in a crowd even back then. All right, brilliant. Um, so this is your third year at the Fringe. Fourth. Right? Fourth, fourth year. What do you love about performing at the Fringe? It's lovely, what's lovely, and I was only just saying earlier today, you know, because everyone has a, has a different experience yeah. and it can be really tough, you know, it's 30 days, it's a long time, four weeks to be away from home and just plugging with your same show, but it's lovely to hone a show, there's no other um, situation where you get 30 days to really test out a show and say, okay, that really works, that really doesn't work, and, and just be, the, be at the top of your game yeah. by the time you leave. Albeit with bronchitis and collapsed lungs, but you know. And you get to see other people's shows, which is really nice, I think. It's uh, lovely. You get to see the same people every year, see how they progress. You know, it's a lovely kind of, you know, uh, union. A union of people every year. Yeah. Which is good. So, how does this year's show differ from your other shows? Different, well, not actually, some characters from last year, but on the whole, it's more of a, it has a beginning, middle, and end in oh, terms yeah. of, it's more of a live TV sketch yeah. show. Yeah, we've, we've got bookended some of our characters that we've had from the past few years are back with, with, with development. So you might see an arc, you might see them back two times, three times, and you just, you know, the, the characters that people have loved from two years ago are still here in different um, scenarios, for want of a better word. <laughs> and um, yeah. Yeah. So you do a lot of accents, don't you? Is that something yeah. that comes naturally, or do you have to really practice them all? No, I think they come naturally. We yeah. live in South East London, so you know, we're yeah. all on our doorstep. Very diverse, you know, one minute you're just talking, it's, it's just multicultural, um, we've grown up with that, and um, yeah, so it comes quite easy. Yeah. So why should people come and see your show? Why not? Why yeah. not is the I mean, good question. reason. It's, it's good, good fun, it's fast moving, you know, yeah. lots of different characters. Yeah, the energy rarely dips, I mean, we've worked, we... We like to think. No, we like, we've, we've <laughs> been, and we've been told, so it's really nice. We worked really hard at that, that was one of the yeah. things we just really did, so it's bang, bang, bang big colourful characters, you know, if you like that sort of thing, then it's yeah. definitely... Yeah, it's not a shy show though, you know, so yeah, you know, maybe leave, leave your mother at home, bring your dealer along, what? Well, <laughs> not, I'd say. Brilliant, well, would you guys mind doing a little part of your show for us? Yeah, should we do everything? Okay. Yeah, I reckon. Yeah. So, do you mind, I just need to, I mean, this brings the character to life. <laughs> As does this. <laughs> I like your matching yeah. jeans, that's cool. I know, aren't they good? We didn't plan this. <laughs> we didn't plan this. <laughs> we wanted to match our flyers, you see. Oh, very cool, I get it, yeah. Now we're I've just actually got one of your badges. Oh, oh brilliant. Yeah. We're with pride. Now, yeah. we usually have an intro to this, so we'll just tell you, we are the Middleton sisters, Kate and Pippa, and there's a little slant on it. We're we'll just do it. We'll just do it. We'll just go into it. Oh, kid, me can't believe me big sister be living in a palace now. True, Pippa, but me not get a moment to relax. Me got all them duties now. But you be a princess now. You got all the money in the world. Check this, the royal family not carrying no cash. Hmm? The last time we saw the Queen's head press up against a note was back in March last year. I took a line of Charlie with Zara Philip on me hand oh, How can me forget? She be hoovering up all that be put down. Uh -huh. We have to nickname her Dyson. True. Anyway, you'll be a princess now. I married that poor prince. You seem to say to me husband, mm -hmm. him now got a lick of hair. Ah, true, true. Him just turned 30 years old. By the time he gets to 40, him be looking like Humpty Dumpty. Yeah, it's true, 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 you know. So tell me what the queen be like in real life. The queen? She's so stiff on. And she always school faces me at breakfast like so. And let me tell you something, her chat be dry. <laughs> We'll stop there. Stop there. <laughs> if you want to see the rest, you have to come along. But they yeah, appear more than once. Brilliant. Well, thank you very much for coming and speaking yesterday. I am listening to Shelley watching Waffle TV. Waffle TV. <laughs>